In the Calculus 1 sequence, looking at derivatives of exponential and logarithmic functions, and here we're actually going to use what we know about derivatives of these types of functions to compute the derivative of a really strange function, the derivative of f of x equals x to the x. And the technique that we're going to use is called logarithmic differentiation. And so let's take a look at this method. It's a very powerful, elegant method. So we're starting with y equals x to the x. Now realize we've differentiated x to a constant power. We've differentiated a constant to a variable power, but this is a variable to a variable power. And so this is something that cannot be addressed by the techniques we've looked at so far, but we'll use this idea of logarithmic differentiation. This idea involves taking the logarithm of both sides of this equation. So I'll write ln of y equals ln of x to the x. Now the reason for doing this is that there is a rule of logarithms that will let us simplify the right-hand side. So recall that if you have ln of a to the r power, you can pull the factor of r out in front, out in front and have r times ln of a. And so that's what we'll do here. We have ln of x to the x. We can pull a factor of x out in front and have x times ln of x. And what we've achieved so far is that we've moved that variable exponent out of the exponent position. And now we'll be able to attack this problem. And on the left, we have ln of y. Now at this point, we're going to use implicit differentiation. And if you haven't seen implicit differentiation, or if you need a refresher in it, there's a tutorial as well in our series that looks at implicit differentiation. So we'll use implicit differentiation here. And so what I'm going to do is differentiate both sides of this equation with respect to x. And so I'm taking a line here just to write down my plan of differentiating both sides with respect to x. And now we'll carry that out. On the left, derivative of ln of y with respect to x is a chain rule problem. We have derivative of ln of y of x differentiating with respect to x we get 1 over y times dy dx. On the right, we have a product rule problem. And so we get first function x times derivative of second function. Derivative of ln of x is 1 over x, plus second function, so ln of x, times derivative of x, with, which is 1. Now, realize that dy dx is actually derivative of x to the x with respect to x, since y equals x to the x. And so dy dx is actually what we're looking for here. And so we can solve for dy dx by multiplying through by y. And we'll have dy dx equals y times, now I'm going to do a little bit of simplifying on the right hand side here. x times 1 over x is 1, and then ln of x times 1 is just ln of x. Now, again on the left, what we have is simply derivative with respect to x of x to the x, because after all, y equals x to the x here. On the right, I'm going to replace y by x to the x, and we'll have x to the x times 1 plus ln of x. And that will be our result. That is the derivative formula for the derivative of x to the x. And we accomplished this using this logarithmic differentiation technique, which relied on our being able to differentiate logarithms.